Hey guys, so I got a tip of a jack stuck in my headphone socket of the Avid Mbox Pro 3. I managed to get it out and I'll show you how I did it. So there's a jack plug stuck in the socket over here. It just broke off the tip of it. So I'm trying to disassemble this uh, this uh, piece of hardware and see if I can push it out. These come off and it's still sticky here so you can put them back on. There's screws underneath them. put these ones on myself because I lost one of these uh, rubber things. Now I regret doing that. <coughs> right. Look at that. I gotta figure this out. These knobs, they come off. So that revealed all these screws on the front panel. These small ones, so that small screw should go in where you can see silver. Where you see black, the big ones go. We have movement. I think I just turned on the limiter. So the jack sockets are actually closed from the back. Uh, let me look at this for a second. I want to take a closer look so I'm going to take these screws off this PCB so I'll be able to move it around a bit. Another screw right there.
by the way, what I just did, did, you see these little black parts that hold this together? You can just click them out so you can release this for better access. So the jack plug is stuck in this one. Let's see how I can get it out. Actually, I managed to uh, to take this thing. It was covering the back of the, the headphone socket. I managed to pry it out with uh, my little friend over here. One step closer to my goal. Oh god, something clicked. Do you see that? Victory! Jesus Christ, that was a long trip. Whew. I'm glad I don't have to piece all this shit together again. Oh wait, I do. <clears throat> Insert time lapse. You should be wise and not have the M box connected to the power network before you open it up because without saying you shouldn't want to die to take out the tip of a jack. It was a pain in the ass but I got it done and I'm happy I did it. Now I just hope the thing still works. I didn't break off any capacitors and stuff like that. We'll see.